I want to bring up one other thing having to do with Hillary Clinton that I know you're eager to talk about, Essie, which huh. is uh, she tried to walk in a parade uh, yesterday in New Hampshire, and I think we have some photographs of this, uh, to cordon off the press. <laughs> uh, they were put in this moving uh, rope line uh, a la a veal pen. And, uh, <laughs> Uh, this is uh, obviously making a lot of uh, waves on social media. Although I have to say, I see a lot of Republicans loving it because they hate us more than they hate her. <laughs> well, I mean, this is humiliating. This is humiliating for reporters who have to abide by Hillary Clinton's rules of journalism. And it's not just this. I mean, the entire campaign, she has, you know, kept them at a distance. She barely answers questions. There's all these rules. And, and actually, I don't blame her. I blame reporters who put up with this. The second they decide, we're not doing this anymore, we're not going to cover your glossy yeah. events the way you want it, then she'll be forced to change this behavior. To a point, you're right, but she also has Secret Service protection, so it's, it's very common for reporters to follow the rules. I think this, though, the criticism is directed at the Clinton campaign on this. We're yes. trying to wrap her in bubble wrap this entire campaign and not let her actually associate with real people. That's where the criticism Terrible. on this, I think, goes, not to the reporters. Okay. The, the the relationship between the Clinton campaign and the press is just hostile on both sides, and it's early for that. Yeah. I mean, if it's like we're how many months out, and if it's that hostile now, it's and dope. reporters are being penned off like farm animals, then you know where is it going to go? <laughs> I, I, well, I love Hillary Clinton, but this is the worst visual metaphor. Before you could say she's not talking to reporters, but you can't cover not talking. You can show this image over and over again, and it's awful. And I predict that like the Michael Dukakis <laughs> tank moment, which was so sort of visually emblematic of his failing campaign, this will actually be a lasting image that she will have to combat going forward. Let's, 